Do you see that haircut? Do you see it? Yeah. Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. It is short, but it is comfy. Now, anyway, there was something over here that you might have noticed. Oh, look at that secret little path here. Oh boy. It says here, beware. The sea is raging today. Protect our beach from boopers. <laughs> so, well, what, is, what does that mean there? Oh, here's a blooper. Hmm, well, what can we do about that blooper? Well, how about we hit it with a ball? That's, you know, that sounds like a nice thing to do. <laughs> so we're gonna hit the blooper. No wind or, oh, whoa, whoa, no wind or anything there. I just wanna kinda make sure I'm centered there. It's kinda hard to tell if you're centered on the, the overhead screen there. It's, it's good for imprecise stuff, but when it goes to the precise stuff, this screen right here, the 3D screen, that's the one that you're looking for. But anyway, let's do it. Let's hit that blooper and lose our ball in the great sea. <laughs> oh, poor blooper. They were just swimming there harmlessly. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Now, remember that other secret path that I taught you about earlier? Well, he's like, oh, you can't get me now. Oh, yes, I can. <laughs> yeah, there's a, well, it's not, I guess it's not really a secret path because there's a bridge leading to it, but you know, you don't really think about that it's going to lead to a blooper side quest ahead of time because, well, where do you see Mario characters in this game, really, <laughs> for the most part? So here we go. Let's practice. And we got ourselves a much longer shot. And it's aiming directly at it, but with the wind, I think I'm going to go seven iron and hit just a little past it. Well, you know, with the impact marker, because the wind is going to bring it back. And let's see how that turns out. And... Oh, it went over! <laughs> you! 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 Stinker! And yeah, I, if you miss, it kind of kind of resets. Alas. Alas. Let's try that again. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe play for a little too much win there. That's okay. So yeah, I gotta do multiples of these. In a row here. Wait, what? what? You're not, you're not hanging out. What? Can I like? Are you gonna show up on the screen? You are not. You are not. Okay, I gotta reset the area here for a second. <laughs> oh blooper. Oh blooper. You're just messing around with me in every which way possible, mocking me and my normally good stroke. <laughs> uh, and there we go. This will reset it. <laughs> Alright, let's start. So maybe I should have checked that sign before, because maybe that would have maybe that would have done the trick. Anyway. Um oh wait, I'm in a short, that's alright. I mean approach, not short, but yeah. Anyway. Wait, what am I doing with such a strong lofted club? I don't know. <laughs> uh how is that? No, oh, that's a little, a little too much. To the right. How about I go? Actually that should hit it. You know what? Because of the wind. So I'm gonna leave it there, just on the right side of its head, because the wind should push it over to the left, and that works. When you hear that sound, <laughs> you know you've got it. All right, moving along with the groove on. Let's try it again, and 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 there's the mocking stinker, stinker. Oh, what am I doing? I can't cross that. <laughs> I can't jump the ledges. This is this is Pokemon. Anyway, well, they're not really ledges. They're more like hard slopes. All right, whoop. All right, blooper. Revenge time for your past mockings. Let's do it. Oh, geez, I got seven again. Um, how's that looking? Okay, I'm gonna trust that and hope for the for the, for the best here, because it looked kind of longish on the angle. I got it! Yeah! <laughs> oh no, I killed it! I killed it! <sighs> I'm sorry, blooper. But I got the sparkly thing, which is... A custom ticket B. What? What is this custom ticket for? Well, we're gonna find out later. But for now, we've got something else to do. Namely, another side quest back over... 
back over on the overworld here. Remember? Remember this over here? The go-go gates? Let's give it a shot. <laughs> because now we can do the palm course, since we kind of got the hang of the seeing around the course and how the course is laid out and stuff and stuff. So we're going to get level two going on here. See the palm tree icon on the sign? Yup, yup, yup. Here we are, only the course is now abandoned for some reason. It's like an alternate dimension for the course. <laughs> Alright, so now as you can tell here, the, the, the gates are in a lot harder position than they were before. You can't really hit the green here, so what we gotta do is hit, hit through the gate and then get up and down from wherever the ball lands. So, I'm just gonna kinda try and top spin it through the gates. And I really love this music here. <laughs> this is my favorite song from Toadstool Tour. And it's got a little remix here. And anyway, I gotta land it right next to the hole, preferably because, you know, it's got the nice flat ground there so I don't have to move the cursor or anything like that. And voila. One down, two to go. Uh, where is, oh, that's, that's an awkward position. But I think I can man, like, those gates there, it looks almost like palm tree layout. <laughs> but yeah, I think I can manage that if I hit off to the side of the green again. You know, I, I prefer not to hit... Oh, I hit a tree. <laughs> uh, yeah, I prefer... Well, actually, maybe I can mess with this a little bit. Yeah, I can, I can get to the green. Just as long as I curve my ball left to right. See that? See that? Yeah. So I'm going to do that. Drop and stop, sort of, kind of, if I can with the driver with super backspin. It's just going to bounce over, though, because that's yeah, it's not my preferred shot. But anyway, I'll get up and down from here. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty confident to be able to say that. <laughs> I'm not sure I'd feel that confident in real life, but yes. <laughs> there we go. Completed. And, and, uh, we got triple gate threat go- actually, it's five- wow, what- whoa, holy- um, wait, one, two, three, where's the fifth of gates? Like, where is, I got, see, I got a plan ahead for this. Like, what is, okay, so I hit, gotta hit, like, around here, I gotta hit up through to here, and then to the green, got it. Alright, okay, yes, yes. <laughs> so I'm gonna hit, preferably down that slope this time, I think. So I'm gonna power. Mm, maybe I know. Mm, yeah. I'll take it back a little bit and let it trickle down the slope on its own. It's all about the planning. Well, I miss it the impact, but I think it'll be fine regardless. Um, yeah, that that's good. And then I'll do a, a right to left curve through all the gates. Well, if I have to. And oh, actually, yeah. Um, because I'm in the rough, that's kind of messing with me a bit here. Uh, um. Well, it looks like I'll make it through all of them. Uh, well, let's hope for the best. One, two, three, four, and, and get up there, get up there. Yeah, that's fine. As long as I get through the third gate, I should be able to make it up and down for par. I mean, it's not third gate, third shot for the last gate. And I'll just hit over, over to the rough, I guess. Uh... Yeah, well, I could actually get away with the fairway, but I'm, I'm fine the rough. And yeah, oh shoot, well I mishit that, but should still make it, yeah, I made it through the gate. And, alright, two shots for par. Can I do it with a drop and stop? Oh, you know I can. <laughs> Just a little bit to the right of the hole, plop it down, and ah. Oh! That's just like the ultimate finisher to that one. And then and, and I'll like once I'll level you up for her this time and oh I'm short. Well whatever. <laughs> uh let's see. Mm -hmm. Let's straighten the shot a little bit. There we go. New course unlocked. <laughs> Woo! Oh yeah, thank you, thank you. And now I'm going to show you... No, 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 that's going to be the Dunes course. And now I'm going to show you another side game here, because I have extra time. Behold, the club shots. Leave your available clubs off.
off the fates. This is Lucky Country. It has the club slots, and yeah, it's a pretty fancy place. <laughs> it's like a casino of sorts. And uh, best of luck if you decide to play this. Uh, it's much easier to do when you have a higher uh, drive distance, but it's possible to do at any drive distance like like normal. But yeah, as you can tell, there's a similar set of pipes going on here. We've got a similar rally of three holes going. So here we are at the Ocarina Green. Whoops, I clicked a little, a little too quickly. And here we go. Now, if you get three stars, you have access to all your clubs. But if you don't, but if you don't get all three stars, and you just get, get like one star or two star, well, oh, it stopped me automatically. Well, I better go a little bit faster then. But yeah, if you, if you get star on something that you don't get all the stars for, you're actually going to be limited to just the other clubs that you got in your repertoire. See, I got three iron, I got pitching wedge, I got three wood. So that's all I've got for this, and I've got to make do with what I've got. So let's see what we can do here. As long as I make it under par, or par, I will be pleased with the results of this. Oh, 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 oh yeah! <laughs> this is probably one of the times that you're going to have to be dealing with shots that you aren't used to doing, like maybe lower shots that I'm not used to doing over the drop and stop, but... Well, well, well... Uh... I just want to get, just want to get some decent clubs here. I'm not really going for all stars. As nice as it sounds, it's not really worth it losing clubs. Because just imagine if you had a pitching wedge for a par five the whole way through, or, or I mean, or a long par four the whole way through. It just not going to make it easy. You just you want you want the length more than anything. Uh, you just want to sort of do what you can do. And since I have to hit this hit to the green with such a low shot, I'm gonna super backspin it, the drop and stop it. Oh yeah, <laughs> that is nice. Almost went in, and here comes the birdie. Our scores continue to drop, and the oh shoot! Oh oh, oh shoot! Uh, well I got five iron as my best. Well you're gonna see what it's like now, I guess. I'm gonna try and. Oh, I just, I was going to say I almost lost my power shot there, but yeah, I'm gonna, you're going to see now how it's going to be if you have a 5 iron or something low the whole way through. So now i gotta got to position myself but potentially between the trees there. Oh shoot, well, that's okay, I guess. I think it's going to run out to my preferred location. Because yeah, I know where the green is, it's, it's just to the right over there. So I think that's a good angle. Yeah, look at that. But I still gotta get it on. I think I'm gonna have to let it run out completely. So I'm not gonna put any spin on this. If need be, I would have even put top spin on that, but I don't think that's gonna be necessary here. Oh, that's actually gonna be a little too much. Oh, that's okay. As long as I get par or better for, for the entire set of three holes. And there we go. I moved it a little bit too far over to the left, but it turned out just fine. And I'll level up. I'll even it out. There we go. And now I should probably, probably start increasing the drive distance again. Like, it's much more helpful for me than it is for him to uh, get, get the uh, other stats up. You know, because of the impact area and stuff like that, there's a human error aspect to that. And yeah, yeah. <laughs> I will challenge number two because I'll because this will be the palm one. See, three holes with power better. Oh, actually, well, I'm near 15 minutes, but whatever. I started it. I started it. Let's just continue on with it. <laughs> anyway, palm club version two. I'll try and speed it up. <laughs> uh, ooh, driver. That's nice. Wait, actually, no, that's not nice. This is par 3, wasn't it? Yeah, uh, well, oh, 5 iron is nice. <laughs> yeah, driver would be pretty annoying on something this short. <laughs> if I only had the driver as my option to make the green, but luckily I got that 5 iron, so... Anyway, eh, that is club, shots, club slots in a nutshell. There we go. <laughs> it's got the pretty... And what do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Three wood, nothing, pitching. <laughs> well, that's okay, I guess. 
because pitching wedge can be used for the, the short shots. Uh, uh, but I'd have to hit so off, so far off line. <laughs> as long as I don't lose my power shot too, I guess that'll be fine for the future. But hitting three wood onto that plateaued green at, at such an angle, at such an angle. Oh, see, see, uh, <laughs> I gotta go way back. And I guess I'll do that. And then I guess I'll do super backspin <laughs> because I'm hitting at such a low trajectory, at such a high plateau. Oh, that! That wow! <laughs> that turned out a lot better than I was thinking it was going to. And there we go, another birdie. So I could double bogey this last hole and still pull it off. Uh, driver seven iron pitching wedge is pretty good. That's pretty balanced actually. Mm, and I'll go all the way up and then control it with super backspin I think that will do and yeah that's good that's good uh, can I make the green in too that would be hilarious oh wait I don't want to hit the ridge just want to oh man oh man I see an opportunity here an opportunity for greatness can I get an eagle on club slots? Probably not, but we're gonna see. <laughs> oh man, I don't even think I have to move the cursor that much. Uh, I'll just move it a smidge. I set a smidge over to the left. And, oh shoot, I overhit it. That's not gonna make it. Yeah, the brake isn't gonna take it down. I overhit it like that. Well, well, well. Here we go. Birdie pot. But I almost got the eagle. <laughs> and... Yeah, I'll do, do level up on her power again. Just because. Yeah, there we go. Help it out. And... It is unlocked. Dune's course, as you would expect. But for now, I'm gonna end off the part here. No, no, no. I, that's new courses to us. <laughs> So yeah, with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when I continue my Palm Club questing. Like, say, maybe, or maybe not, a match play. Ooh. Ooh. Anyway, saving. <laughs>